Mauricio Shogun Hua, Chuck Liddell, and here we go. Chuck Liddell uses what we call his wrestling in reverse. We don't often see him go for the takedown, but because he has great takedown defense, that forces their, his opponents to fight his game. Yeah, he is really the first guy that really uh, perfected that style. The style of using his great wrestling to avoid the takedown and to force guys to stand up and trade with him. And he has forced many a great submission specialist like Marula Bustamante was forced to stand with him. So many fighters are forced to play Chuck Liddell's game because his wrestling is so strong. And the crowd responds, oh, that's a big shot. Oh! Joe, you always see the overhand right and the counters from Chuck Liddell, but still his kicks can end a fight instantaneously. He doesn't throw them as often because he wants to make sure he doesn't get taken down, but when they land, they are devastating. The Iceman Chuck Liddell. You can't take him down very easily, and if you do, it's hard to keep him down. He is one of the best fighters in the world at getting back up to his feet and brawling. And he is the first wrestler that uh, ever utilized that style of, of fighting where he's using his wrestling in reverse. He uses his wrestling to keep the fight on the feet. Nice job, double leg. He's working hard for that leg lock. He lost it. Nice escape. Chuck Liddell, with his ability to counter, isn't afraid to let a fighter start to feel comfortable with their striking game because the minute they do, oftentimes it's good night. He lures them into a trap, and he's excellent at capitalizing on just the smallest openings. Transitions to north-south, trying to rain down some strikes. Back to side control. Great job on the reversal. Body shot. One minute remains. Wow. And down he goes. And he decides to let him up. Oh, oh nice quick kick. kick. He's looking for the highlight reel finish. He shoots with the takedown. He's got the single, and he's got him down. Postured up. Final seconds of round number one. What a great brawl in that round. Both fighters leaving everything inside the eye. Let's take a look at some of the... You're looking great, okay? It's all range, that point. The beautiful Ariani. Set for round number two. Fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. The interesting thing about the shooter box camp in Brazil, the one in which Mauricio Shogun Hua comes from, is they go at it on a daily basis. There's no playing around if you're going to be a member of that team. Yeah, there's a lot of debate about whether or not that's a good idea, but they fight full blast in the gym and knock each other out on a regular basis. Probably not the best idea for your brain. A minute into round number two. He's eating some punches. The interesting thing about Chuck Liddell, and, and a lot of people don't notice this because they just see the result of the big strikes, is that his angles are perfect. His angles are perfect, Mike, and his accuracy is outstanding. He's very good at slipping punches past opponent's guard and landing them right on the chin. Can we see it again? Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest, declaring the winner by knockout. The Man, Chuck Liddell, the winner by knockout.